Hey there, Mary Sirkwa here with Red at Home Realty, bringing you another market report for the month of April. The Toronto Real Estate Board just announced their numbers, and not too surprisingly, there were double digit gains year over year. And uh, last year we were in full lockdown at this point, the pandemic just hit, and uh, the real estate market was in a bit uh, of a standstill at that point. But again, there were double digit uh, increases year over year from April 2020 to April 2021. We'll be reviewing some of the numbers for Aurora and for Newmarket. So let's begin right now. So let's start by reviewing a new market. In new market, there were a total number of sales of 206, uh, 338 new listings, 182 total active listings, and the average days on market was only nine days. The average sales price for the month was $1,079,700, which was a 33.1% year over year increase. The sales to listing ratio was at 61%. So again, anything over 60% is considered a seller's market. So we are still very much so in a seller's market at this point. The average sales price for a detached home in New Market was $1,211,800, which was a 30.9% year over year increase. For a semi detached in a New Market was $820,000, which was a 22.5% increase. The average price for a townhome in New Market went up to $884,400, which was a 33.9% increase. Just that's just incredible. And finally, for a condo townhome that had gone up to $756,300, which was a 25.6% increase. Next, we'll look at the numbers in Aurora. Aurora had 190 sales that took place, uh, 268 new listings, and 152 active listings. The average days on the market was only 10 days for the month of April. The average sales price in Aurora had gone up to $1,278,000, which was a 35% year over year increase. The list to sales ratio was at 71%. So again, we uh, Aurora was in a very strong seller's market for the month of April as well. The average sales price for a detached home in Aurora had gone up to $1,482,200, which was a 25.3% year over year increase. The average sales price for a semi detached in Aurora had gone up to $944,200, which was a 25.4% increase. The average price for a townhome in Aurora had gone up to $971,000. That was a 30% year over year increase. And finally, for a condo townhome in Aurora that had gone up to $834,000, which was a 31.4% year over year percentage increase. Just uh, astonishing, really. Well, that's it for all the numbers for Aurora and for New Market for the month of April. If you're interested to find out uh, what your home is going for in your particular area, because each area tends to be a little bit different, uh, reach out to me. I'd love to give you a free market online evaluation and that's uh, no obligation whatsoever. You can also hit uh, the link down below for doing that online yourself. I look forward to seeing you here next time. Take care and stay safe.